Hi. Did you know that over 80% of households in the UK boil a kettle every single day? That's a lot of kettles being heated. But have you ever wondered just how much electricity that actually uses? Today we're diving into the fascinating world of kettles and their energy consumption. With energy costs on the rise, understanding how much electricity we use for everyday tasks like boiling water is more important than ever. So let's get started. Now here's the thing. Many people think that boiling a kettle is no big deal. When it comes to electric usage, it's just a quick click, right? But that's a common misconception. While it might seem insignificant in the grand scheme of things, those quick bursts of energy can really add up, especially if you're using your kettle multiple times a day. So let's take a closer look at what's going on and when you flick that switch. First off, let's talk about how kettles actually work. Most kettles have an average wattage of between 2,000 and 3,000 watts. When you fill up your kettle and hit that boil button, it's sucking up a serious amount of power. To put that into perspective, that's much more than any other household appliance, like a microwave or a toaster. For example, a microwave might use around 1,000 watts, while a toaster typically uses about 800 watts. So why does this matter? Well, if you're boiling water in your, for your morning tea or coffee, that kettle could be using more power in a, just a few minutes than your toaster would for an entire breakfast session. So what does that actually mean? What does it actually cost to boil your kettle? Well, let's break it down. If you're boiling a full kettle, we'll say 1.5 litres, it can use up to 0.1 to 0.15 kilowatt hours of energy. With electricity prices hovering around about the 30 pence a kilowatt, kilowatt hour, that means you're looking at around three to four and a half pence per boil. If you're boiling your kettle four times a day, that's around 12 to 18 pence a day. Or put it another way, 43 to 66 pounds a year. That's a hell of a chunk of change. And if you're one of those people who loves a cup of tea throughout the day, these costs are really gonna add up. So there you have it. Boiling a kettle might seem like a small task, but it can have a significant impact on your electricity bill. By being conscious on how much and how often you use your kettle and how much water you're boiling, this is the most important thing, you can actually save money in the long run. Now, I want to hear from you. How often do you use your kettle and have you ever thought about how much it costs? Share your thoughts in the comments below. And if you want to learn more about energy saving in your home, check out my video on energy saving tips. Thanks for watching. I'll see you in the next one.